Hello, this is Barry and Taylor from King Neutronics. Today we're going to show you how to calibrate a high pressure test gauge using a hand pump. So here's our system. We have the device under test, which is a high pressure gauge. This particular one goes up to 10,000 psi. Uh, we will today probably only get to about 3,000. Uh, we have a test stand which it's connected to. From there it's connected with a hose to our hand pump. So first of all, we're going to use the, the pneumatic mode of the hand pump to build up a pressure. And the purpose of this is just to show how easy it is to create a test pressure. So right now we can go up to about 500 psi pretty easy using the hand pump but for the purpose of this test we're going to stop at about 250 psi so as you can see pretty easy to get up to 250 psi but to calibrate our gauge at a high pressure we're going to need to switch to a hydraulic mode so what we're going to do first of all we're going to vent the pump And we're going to connect the hydraulic reservoir. And our hydraulic reservoir contains distilled water. The reason we use distilled water is because it does not contaminate the internal components of the pump or the hose or the gauge. So now what we're going to do is we're going to switch the pump to vacuum mode and we're going to start to generate a vacuum. What this does is it evacuates the air out of the system. So once we've generated a pretty sufficient vacuum we're going to open up the vent valve and what this will do will draw water into our system. The reason why we're drawing water into the system is so that we don't get um, issues with compression of any air that's in the system when we generate a high pressure. So Taylor's going to going to cycle through the vacuum and venting a couple of times just to make sure the system has enough water and as much air as possible has been removed. Then we're going to switch over to the to the uh, pressure mode and once again use the hand pump to generate the high pressure. So as you can see very quickly we can get up to about 250 psi. But to really build up a high pressure, we're going to use the volume adjuster. And what this does, this compresses the liquid inside a small cavity. And this allows us to build the pressure very, very quickly. So for the purposes of this test, we're going to go to about 3,000 psi. As we get closer to 3000. What we're going to do is we're going to switch from using the coarse knob, which is the black knob, to the fine adjustment using the green knob. Using this fine adjustment, we're able to adjust very, very accurately up to about 3000 psi, or I should say exactly 3000 psi. And there you go, 3000 psi using a hand pump.